guys so today i'm gonna be making some banana nut bread um i have some ripe bananas ripe bananas that i need to use up um so i'm gonna be making some banana nut bread um in the crock pot and i'm gonna show you how i make it um this is a recipe i found a while back um and it is delicious so I'm gonna be showing you guys the ingredients. Alrighty guys, so you're gonna need two cups of flour. You're gonna add your choice of mixture. I added um, chocolate chips, raisins, walnuts. You can also add um, coconut shreds. Okay, so you're also gonna be needing one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, and then um, half a teaspoon of salt. Okay, so you're also going to need one cup of sugar, and then you're going to need two eggs, then eight tablespoons of butter. The butter has to be softened, okay? So you could just leave it out for a while, and it has to just let it get soft. And then you're going to need three bananas, a bowl to mix all the ingredients, and lastly, you will need your crock pot and your lid, of course. Um... I'm just gonna be putting some butter on it. You can use Pam if you would like, but I don't have Pam. And that is all the ingredients. Okay guys, so we will be mixing our sugar, our eggs, our butter in this bowl, and then um, also our vanilla extract. Make sure you mix it all well. Once you have that all mixed, you're gonna add your one cup of flour in there. You're not gonna add all of it at the same time. So you have two cups, you're gonna add half of it. You're also gonna be adding one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, and half a teaspoon of salt in there. You're gonna mix it all in there, incorporate everything all nicely. Okay, so once we have that all mixed up, then we're gonna start on our bananas. We're gonna grab a bowl. We're gonna peel our bananas, all three bananas. You're gonna peel them, take any brown spots that you see or any like ugliness in the bananas out of it. Um, and you're just gonna squish the bananas with a fork until you get a mushy consistency. You're gonna want it to be like puree type. Like if you're gonna feed a baby, but in reality you're not so just like that that's how you want your consistency <laughs>
okay guys so once you have that bananas all mixed and um mushy you're gonna want to um incorporate that to your mixture to your big bowl and you're gonna want to mix it real well make sure that everything is nicely incorporated to everything And at this time you're gonna want to add all your nuts your raisins your walnuts um, I'm gonna be adding raisins walnuts and chocolate chips We're gonna put it all around our crock pot. Make sure to get all the little edges. And we're gonna add in our mixture. Okay, guys, so we're gonna put it on low for four hours. We're gonna have the napkin on it and it's gonna catch all the moisture in there. Um, but yeah, so low for four hours. Check it out, three hours and a half. See how it's doing. Um, but that's all to it. Alrighty, guys, so the banana nut bread is ready. It has been around like four hours, so I'm just going to turn it off. Don't forget to turn it off. Don't burn your house. We're going to lift up the lid, take off the little napkin on top, and reveal. Look at that. Reveal the bread. So you're going to want to let it sit, but I am eager to know how it tasted. You don't know me? You're fat. <laughs> no, I love to, I love to um, eat junk food. Cause you're fat. <laughs> Cause I'm not fat. I just love to eat junk food. Oh damn. Look at that. Banana nut bread, and you didn't have to wait for it in the oven. It's all nice Put a little bit of lemon zest on it. No. <laughs> so we're just gonna cut it. Well, you guys can see how it looks. I can finish my video. But, oh my goodness. You're gonna want to let it rest for like 15 minutes. No, don't be me. Did you wash your hands, babe? Yes, I did. Wash your hands. Did you sanitize them? <laughs> yes. COVID. But look at the bread. Look at that. So pretty. Then you're gonna want to eat it. Burn your mouth. Uh huh. Burn your mouth. <laughs> but you're good. Huh? Take them. <laughs> Look at that. You see the heat? Yeah. Alrighty guys, so my this is my finished product of my banana nut bread. Look at that beauty. <laughs> 
hope you really do try it out. Um, the banana nut bread, honestly, it's amazing. It tastes really good. Um, my kids love it. My husband loves it. So give it a try if you guys like it. Um, comment down below what, uh, what other kind of recipes you guys would like to watch. Um, nothing with baking because I don't bake in the oven. <laughs> I'm like, but you can tell me any other recipes that you guys would like to see. Um, that's it for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, do the little notification thing. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Bye, guys. Valentine's. Oh, they, they made you this for Valentine's Day? Oh, show them. You like banana bread. I like banana bread. Okay. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and How does it taste? Good. Good? Delicious? Can I eat it? Yeah, you can eat it. Say bye. Bye. Are you ready for Valentine's?